Thumbs up! Oh, what's up, people? We are back with more The Sims 4 or at the hospital. Um, what happened last time? I think we got a promotion, right? All right, let's chat up Finn. Not chat up in the way, you know, just give him a pep talk like, all right, let, let's really work hard today. Not just stare at our patients creepily with those... What kind of glasses are those? It's like he's gonna go go out for skiing or something. So we did get promoted to medical assistance. Gotta treat three patients to become a medical technologist. I actually think that... Uh, we are able to use the x-ray machines now I think which are these which are standing x-ray machines which is actually pretty awesome oh god he's here he's back it, it's really only the same patients isn't it all right let's treat the little boy then we're gonna treat the grandma even <laughs> what Finn really Finn clean that shit up really he, don't talk to me clean. You can't have trash in front of an elderly patient in front of a room. It's like, yep, that's where you belong, old woman. Or at least very, very so soon. Holy crap, this is the most stylish haircut I've ever seen on a grandpa. Unless he dyed his hair gray. His face doesn't look old, you know. But he has this distinguished facial hair with the, the mustache and the little goatee and then the, the hair on the chin. Alright, let's treat, uh, treat the grandpa first. Oh, gas and giggles, but that hairstyle, man, damn. If I'm ever a grandpa, I hope I will be half as stylish as this, with the shaved, short sides, even even in the back, only only long hair up front and then curled. <laughs> Holy dude, he must be very lucky at the old people house, you know. Oh, Kale. His name is Kale. Let's treat this one. What does she have? Also gas and giggles? Everybody. All the old people, they got gas and giggles. She's got pretty stylish hair too. It's kind of this... If it were a little bit longer, it would be maybe be considered somewhat emo-ish, but... I don't know, it just seems very stylish. Like something Victoria Beckham would, would have. I don't know why I'm paying attention to people's hairstyles. So we're not gonna even bother with this guy, okay? So then we're gonna treat the little boy, even though he definitely should have been treated first. Gotta give him a shot. Oh god, I, I seriously hate shots. Oh, the needle. Whenever I see a needle, I just go like... My body automatically tenses up and like... It, it just rejects it. Don't, don't get inside of me. Oh no, don't, don't do it. But by the time it actually does happen, it's like, eh, really, was that it? But still, just the fact that the anticipation of the moment, that you're knowing that you're going to get a shot, and then you see the the, the woman or man or whatever with put on the gloves, and then he opens his cabinet, and then, you know, refer to x-ray station, a scan, and then he grabs, like, the longest needle possible that there is, even though there's probably no need for it, he still decides to grab the longest one. And you're like, oh crap. And seriously, sometimes you see the length of the needles and I wonder like, how the hell is that gonna fit in my bony arm? Because I'm pretty, I mean, I'm pretty skinny. So I wonder like, sometimes I see like a needle and it would go like straight through my arm. It would poke out on the other side of my arm. And I'd be like, what the hell? Why doesn't that happen? But it's gotta be like something where it goes inwards. If there's too much, when it hits, before it even hits the bone, I don't know. I'm not a medical, well, I am kind of, in The Sims I am, but not in real life, because I don't know anything about it. Uh, what does he want? Scan the patient's body. Oh, yes! Let's scan his body. Now we can forever uh, try and bust the myth of whether Justin Bieber, or the black Justin Bieber, is actually a girl or a guy. Look at me, so happy. Oh, my first CT scan. Or x-ray scan, actually. Pretty unorthodox to do it, you know, standing. Uh, oh. oh. You have arms. Great. A leg. A torso. Hands. Everything seems fine. 
I'd be so scared if those things were twirling around me and I'd just be standing there. Honestly, that machine is terrifying. Oh god. See, he, he scanned his uh, uh, shrinky dink right there. I was like, nope, no object found. Oh god. <laughs> he seems kind of pleased though, like, oh. Here we go again. Gotta check a second time. We found? Performed, has successfully performed a practice exam in his practice. The test results seem valid, but the specific data is a bit over his head and will be passed along. So we're good enough to actually take an x-ray machine, but we can't do anything with the results. We need more training. So we scanned the patient's body using... What? Scan body of a patient using a, using a medical probe to check the vitals of a patient... Oh, so that wasn't what we had to do. It's something here. Scan body. What the hell? <laughs> what kind of scan is that? I have honestly no idea. Um, we were a bit too eager to try and immediately do the x-ray scan. I just saw scanner and assumed x-ray scan, right? That's not a bad thing of me. Oh! Malfunction! Oh, why did Gunner have to see that? It's like the worst possible moment. Meanwhile, patients are probably piling up again. And I actually gotta go to the bathroom. I'm kinda uncomfortable, so we gotta do that quickly. Then we're gonna wash hands, screw brush our teeth. I mean, we need a little break every now and then too, right? Oh, no, 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 never mind, never mind. Before we do that, we actually gotta transfer the patient case to Gunner. Transfer oh, patient God, case. God, I know, right? Finn is so horrible at his job. Is the trash still there? It's still there. And, you know, look at this puddle of what used to be, uh, I don't know, I, I tried making up a sor certain life form that's entirely created out of water, but I can't think of anything. What is entirely created out of water? I was gonna say like Squirtle, but that's a freaking Pokemon. And he's a turtle. So, if he would have evaporated from something... It wouldn't leave a puddle of water only, it would, it would leave the turtle shell there too. Oh, he's got the dizzy eyes or whatever. I'm actually surprised because last time, was it last time? I think it was last time as well, before I got the promotion that I got sick too. Like one of my patients infected me, or at least I got, yeah, it, it was an infectious disease. I mean, I got it from one of my patients, so it must have been. Unless I like French kiss the dude, which makes no freaking sense, of course, because why the hell would I do that? We're working in a hospital here. I mean, that's the other way, only way I can imagine, you know, uh, bacteria being transferred over. I have no idea why, why I said that, seriously. Oh, crap. Okay. My computer almost went crazy there, but I saved it. Uh, what do we do now? Check the patient's eyes. Examine patients, check the eyes. We already did that. Alright, let's, let's actually make a bet. Let's do some work here, okay? Finn, he is a nurse. Okay, but what was I at the beginning? An intern, right? He's a nurse, so I guess nurse is above intern. But intern has higher capabilities of going higher up, rather as a, whereas a nurse is just taking care of patients mostly. You know what? We're, we're, we're gonna do, I mean, seeing as nobody else, I mean, you can't just have trash laying around in a patient's room, right? Successfully calibrate an x-ray machine. Oh, let's do that. What does the calibration do? Like, honestly, this hospital is way understaffed. It's like only me and Gunner, and then we have three different uh, receptionists or assistants. They're only talking on their cell phone with boyfriends or whatever, like, oh, I'm so bored. Like, there are 10 people watching at me right now, coughing in my face, but I'm so bored. So, we're calibrating. I mean, honestly, this is the future is here. I mean, 
Look at this thing. We're only a couple of years away before we can actually we actually have this ourselves. Probably not, but something similar at least. Like I mean, look at this. Look at these machines. It's like it's like you you you're performing surgery on this computer here, and you're you're actually uh, controlling the robot or the robot arms or whatever. That's what it seems like to me. Surgery. I mean, everything's gonna be so easy in the future. He's back! Caleb Swift. It's seriously only the same people. We need more variety here. I haven't seen her before. Selena Huang. Selena. Medical referral. Admit patients referred to x-ray scan. Wait, did he actually get cured? Seeing as I have to swab a patient uh, or deliver the medication. I think he, Gun Gunner is gonna cure him, right? No, no. <laughs> it was like he went in. Huh. Nope. Definitely forgot something. And he walks back. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. All right. So refer medical. Admit her to a patient bed. Got, got something to do to kill the time. Well, we treated three patients. So medical technologists. They desperately. We we are desperate desperate need of more people man I mean we have more machines than people that can actually use them you know we have two of these meanwhile Gunner is the only one that's allowed to use them two of these as well and I'm the only one allowed well not the only one but okay I'm able to use them now but I don't think I can use I can can't do the treadmill test or what is this uh, or attending a pregnancy or needing surgical treatment so yeah this is for surgery or for pregnant People. We have one nurse, 55 assistants, one doctor, and then we have myself. Like I'm a doctor in training. Soon I'll I'll I'll, I'll become a doctor. What? No! I tried to. Oh God! I tried to. Oh my God! I did an adequate job. Preventative care is the best course, so he needs to step up. I tried to like click on it to lengthen my work day but then it was like nope you did a shitty job today go back home <laughs> oh god well this was a short ending of this video sadly i want i really wanted to do overtime like i always do but maybe i misclicked or something and there was actually like an x or it was just time and i didn't actually extend it before this because the times are mostly mixed up like not every single job it ends at four so i was kind of confused at which time it uh, actually ends but nevertheless next time we'll make up for it double overtime even though we can't but yeah thank you very much for watching please like and subscribe for more in the next video uh, what's in the next one scientists oh we gotta watch our cupcake factory in the basement so yeah peace <laughs>